All right, y'all, peace and blessings. God bless you all. I'm Jarvis Kingston, and I hope that y'all doing all right and staying strong and solid in these times that run. I pray that you have repented and that you are baptized. I pray that you are safe, protected, and prayed up. And I just pray that whatever situation that you're going through, that the Lord is with you, that he guides you, protects you, he looks out for you, he comforts you. I pray that your mental health gets better and that you become more strong and wise in the Lord. I pray that you keep fighting a good fight of faith. You keep running your race. You keep your eyes fixed on the Messiah. You keep your eyes fixed on the prize. You stay on that narrow path that you help out plenty of people along the journey forevermore. Amen. Most definitely, y'all. Let us thank the Lord for another day. Let us thank the Lord for waking us up and giving us another chance to seek his face. Let us thank the Lord for food in our belly, clothes in our back, and a roof over our head. And let us just thank the Lord for protecting us coming in and going out, getting us through the morning, getting us through the evening, getting us through the night. His grace, mercy, favor, love, just protecting us everywhere we go, y'all. His outstretched arm, the mighty hand of God, the finger of God. Just thank him for his word. His only begotten son dying for our sins. Countless of things, amen. There's so much things the Lord has done for us that we just got to give him a whole lot of praise for, amen. So always remember that he will never leave you nor forsake you. All right, always trust in him through every situation and take it one day at a time, all right? Take it one day at a time, people. Yes, yes, welcome, everybody. I appreciate all of you for listening. Supporting means a lot to me. I love you all. Praying for you all. Brothers and sisters in the faith, let us always uplift each other in Christ. Let us always encourage each other in the Lord. Let us pray for one another and comfort one another and help all, help all those people who are lost or uh, don't really have it together as well. Gather them and help them as well, all right? So, much love to the scattered 12 tribes, all the four corners of the earth, all ends of the earth. Much love to the church. Much love to the soon-to-be martyrs. And much love to the engrafted Gentiles. Amen. So much love to all of you people out there, all right? Yes, welcome everyone, all peoples, all nations, all tribes, all languages, all tongues, all races, all faces, all four corners of the earth, all kindreds. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord, all the animals, all the creatures, all the beasts, all the fishes in the sea, the birds in the air, the trees, the plants, the mountains. Let all of God's creation praise him. Amen. Hallelujah, y'all. Yes, yes. Whether you are an Israelite or a Gentile, it is all right. Whether you are chosen or adopted and grafted in, it is all right. Let us gather together and praise the Lord. Sing a new song, clap our hands, stomp our feet, play an instrument. Rejoice, always rejoice, people. Worship in spirit and truth, cry out to him, and serve with gladness and joy, y'all. Just always keep your, your eyes fixed on the Lord forevermore, amen. Just thank him and rejoice, be glad. Don't let nobody take away your, your joy. Don't let nobody steal that from you, okay? You need that stability to get you through in these times, all right? Most definitely. Let us love the Lord our God, Father of our mind, heart, soul, strength, and might. Let us love our neighbors as we love ourselves. And let us keep doing Father's business and Father's will for the rest of our lives until the sun comes back, amen. He has come back like a thief in the night. He has come back at an hour nobody knows but the Father. He has come back for a people who are spotless, blameless, ready to go. Let us keep our lamps. Let us keep our oils. Let us stay ready for Messiah's return. Let us keep doing the Great Commission. Let us keep spreading the gospel. Let us keep doing the will of the Father. And just keep doing that kingdom business, man. Do Father's business, people. Get to it and take it one day at a time and help out and reach out as much people as you can. Amen. Yes, yes, y'all. Let the Lord keep revealing himself to us day by day. Let us know the Lord better. Let's get more close to him. Let us seek his face. Draw near to God. He will draw near to you. Let us obey the gospel. Let us obey the law, statute, commandments. And let us obey all of his word. Anything the Most High has told you personally, according to your purpose, your gift, your life, your calling, or whatever your situation is, honor that, respect that, obey that as well. Amen. Always stay in communication with the Most High through prayer. Always with the requests, the petitions, the supplications, thanksgivings, all of that. Amen. Always go to the Lord for what you need. Amen. Yes, yes, y'all. Welcome, family. Shalom. All right. I hope that you all stay strong out there. Okay. Now, today's message, we're going to go through this commentary within the book of First Samuel. All right. So we'll go through it there with the scripture reading as well. And then from there, we will close out with a prayer. We will close out with a priestly blessing. And we will close out, give all the praise, honor, and glory to the most high God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. And praise his only begotten son who died for our sins. Amen. Hallelujah, y'all. So here we go. Today's Bible reading, the book of 1 Samuel chapter 3, verses 1 through 21. The recommended reading, the book of Proverbs chapter 3, verses 5 through 6. The book of Jeremiah chapter 1, verses 4 through 10. And also the book of Hebrews chapter 3, verses 7 through 19. So first, we will go into 1 Samuel chapter 3, verses 1 through 21. The Lord calls Samuel. The boy Samuel ministered before the Lord under Eli. In those days, the word of the Lord was rare. There were not many visions. One night, Eli, whose eyes were becoming so weak that he could barely see, was lying down in his usual place. The lamp of God had not yet gone out as Samuel was laying down in the temple of the Lord where the Ark of the Covenant was. 
Then the Lord called Samuel. Samuel answered, Here I am. And he ran to Eli and said, Here I am, you called me. But Eli said, I did not call. Go and go back and lie, and lie down. So he went and lie down. And again, the Lord called Samuel. And Samuel got up and went to Eli and said, Here I am, you called me. My son Eli said, I did not call. Go back and lie down. Now Samuel did not yet know the Lord. The word of the Lord had not yet been revealed to him. The Lord called Samuel a third time. And Samuel got up and went to Eli and said, Here I am, you called me. Then Eli realized that the Lord was calling the boy. So Eli told Samuel, go and lie down. And if he calls you, say, speak, Lord, for your servant is listening. So Samuel went and lied down in his place. The Lord came and stood there, calling as at the other time, Samuel, Samuel. And Samuel said, speak, for your servant is listening. And the Lord said to Samuel, see, I am about to do something in Israel that will make the ears of everyone who hears of it tingle. At that time, I will carry out against Eli everything I spoke against his family from beginning to end. For I told him that I would judge his family forever because of the sin he knew about. His sons made themselves contemptible, and he failed to restrain them. Therefore, I swore to the house of Eli, the guilt of Eli's house will never be atoned for by sacrifice or offering. Samuel laid down until morning and then opened the doors of the house of the Lord. He was afraid to tell Eli the vision, but Eli called him and said, Samuel, my son, Samuel answered, here I am. What was it he said to you? Eli asked, do not hide it from me. May God deal with you, be it ever so severely if you hide from me anything he told you. So Samuel told him everything, hide nothing from him. Then Eli said, he is the Lord. Let him do what is good in his eyes. The Lord was with Samuel as he grew up and he let none of his words fall to the ground. And all Israel from Dan to Beersheba to Beersheba recognized that Samuel was attested as a prophet of the Lord. The Lord continued to appear at Shiloh, and there he revealed himself to Samuel through his word. All right, all right, powerful reading, okay? Now, let us go to the recommended reading of Proverbs chapter 3, verses 5 through 6. You know, it's very important to always hear the Lord's voice, people. The Lord be calling us, talking to us, yelling at us, and we got to hear and obey it, you know what I mean? The Lord talks to us through various ways, dreams, visions, that still voice, uh, situations and their interventions, signs, wonders, miracles, uh, random random occurrences that happen throughout the day or what have you. God just be speaking to us people. So we got to obey and always be watchful. You know what I'm saying? Samuel was a young boy and was able to hear God's voice and obey it. So let us apply that to our lives. Okay. So now let's go to Proverbs chapter three, verses five through six. This is many people's favorite scripture. One of my favorites as well, obviously. All right, here we go. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge him, and he shall make your path straight. All your ways, people, all of it, amen. Praise the Lord, people. Another recommended reading I would like to add to read to this one is Jeremiah chapter 1, verses 4 through 10. All right, Jeremiah chapter 1, verses 4 through 10. The call of Jeremiah, the word of the Lord came to me saying, before I formed you in the womb, I knew you. Before you were born, I set you apart. And I appointed you as a prophet to the nations. Our servant Lord, I said, I do not know how to speak. I am only a child. But the Lord said to me, do not say I am only a child. You must go to everyone I send you to and say whatever I command you. Do not be afraid of them, for I am with you and will rescue you, declares the Lord. Then the Lord reached out his hand and touched my mouth and said to me, now I have put my words in your mouth. See, today I appoint you over nations and kingdoms to uproot and tear down, to destroy and overthrow, to build and to plant. Yes, yes, amen, people. Let the Lord speak to us. Let us listen, y'all. Consecrated, set apart, appointed before even birth, before using your mother's womb. Powerful stuff in Jeremiah. Now, the last recommended scripture I want to read prior to this commentary is the book of Hebrews chapter 3, verses 7 through 19. All right, Hebrews chapter 3, verses 7 through 19. Warning against unbelief. So as the Holy Spirit says, today if you hear his voice, do not harden your hearts as you did in the rebellion. During the time of testing in the desert, where your fathers tested and tried me, and for 40 years saw what I did. That is why I was angry with that generation. And I said, their hearts are always going astray, and they have not known my ways. So I declared on oath in my anger, they shall never enter my rest. See to it, brothers, that none of you has a sinful, unbelieving heart that turns away from the living God. But encourage one another daily, as long as it is called today, 
so that none of you may be hardened by sin's deceitfulness. We have to come to share in Christ if we hold firmly to the end the confidence we had at first. As had just been said, as has just been said, today if you hear his voice, do not harden your hearts as you did in the rebellion. Who were they who heard and rebelled? Were they not all those Moses led out of Egypt? And with whom was he angry for 40 years? Was it not with those who sinned, whose bodies fell in the desert? And to whom did God swear they, that they would never enter his rest, if not to choose who disobeyed? If not, if not to those who disobeyed. So we see that they were not able to enter because of their unbelief. Whew. Come on, people, got to believe. Come on now. Don't have that doubt, insecurity, unbelief in you now. We have people full of faith. We live by faith. The just shall live by faith, people, okay? Walk by faith, not by sight, all right? So those are the recommended reading scriptures for this commentary, all right? So now let us get into this commentary. The title of this commentary is, What Are You Listening To? All right, here we go. After serving for many years in South Africa, missionary Robert Muffat returned to Scotland in the early 1800s to recruit more missionaries. When he arrived at one church on a cold winter night, only a small group of women had turned out to hear him. While he was grateful for their interest, he'd hoped to challenge the men of the community to consider serving the tribes in that foreign land. Still, Muffat preached his prepared message on Proverbs 8, chapter, Proverbs chapter 8, verse 4, Unto you, O men, I call. Toward the end of his sermon, the missionary noticed a young boy in the congregation. Although no one volunteered to go to Africa that evening, the little boy was deeply moved by the challenge. That night, the boy promised God he would follow in the footsteps of the missionary. True to his word, when he grew up, he went and ministered to the tribes of Africa. That boy's name was David Livingstone, and he became one of the world's greatest missionaries and adventurers. In this story, we read of another boy who heard a divine call. He heard the call and then accepted what God called, what God had to say to him that night. Unlike Samuel, few of us are, are unlike Samuel, few of us are that open to hearing God's call. Our doubts and fears cause us to ignore God. Instead, we listen to a voice inside that says, God can't possibly use someone like me. I can't do that. I'm not worthy. I'll have to think about that. We push God aside and settle for the voice that speaks to our perceived limitations, fears, fears, worthy commitments, and even our laziness. When God calls us to serve him, he isn't concerned about your age or abilities. Sure, he knows your weaknesses, but he also knows your heart and your potential. He's got a much better perspective than you do on what you can become if you answer his call. Just listen for God's voice in your life and respond. Speak for your servant is listening. In 1 Samuel chapter 3, verse 10. Amen. Things to take away from the commentary. When have you sensed that God was calling you to serve him? What fears and doubts prompt you to ignore God's call? How would answer, answering his call change your life? Quote, unquote, in other words, never doubt in the dark what God told you in the light. Quote, V. Raymond Edmund. All right. So that's the commentary. Amen. So always well, got to listen, obey the Lord. All right. Got to follow through with what he tells us to do. Okay. Most definitely. Yes, yes, y'all. Let us give all glory, honor, Lord. Yes, praise him. Give all the glory to the Lord. All the praise to the Most High. Give him all the praise, honor, and glory to the Lord, y'all. The Lord of hosts, most definitely, true living God. Yes, the true living God, the almighty creator, most definitely, y'all. Yes, his son is the last Adam, the second Adam. Yes, praise the Lord, the advocate, the almighty, true living God, the Alpha and Omega. Amen. The apostle of our profession, the arm of the Lord, the atoning sacrifice for our sins, the author and finisher of our faith. The author and perfecter of our faith, the author of life, the author of salvation, the beginning and the end. The beginning of creation of God, the beloved son, the blessed and only potent, the blessed and only ruler, the branch, the bread of God, the bread of life, the bridegroom, the capstone, the captain of salvation, the chief cornerstone, the chief shepherd, Christ, the Christ of God, the consolation of Israel, the cornerstone, the counselor, wonderful counselor, the creator, the day spring, the deliverer, the desire of the nations, the door, the elect of God, Emmanuel, the eternal life, the everlasting father. The faith and true witness, faithful and true, the faithful witness, the first and the last, the first begotten, the first born from the dead, first born of all creation, the forerunner, the gate, the glory of the Lord, God, the good shepherd, the great high priest, the great shepherd, the head of the church, the heir of all things, the high priest, holy and true, the holy one, the hope, the hope of glory, the horn of salvation, the I am, the I am that I am, the I am who I am, the great I am, the image of God, Jehovah, Jehovah, Jireh, Jehovah, Shalom. 
Yehovah, Jesus of Nazareth, Jesus, the judge of Israel, the judge, king eternal. He is the king of Israel. Amen. He is the king of kings. Hallelujah. He is the king of kings, the Lord of lords. Hosanna, Hosanna of the highest praise. King of saints, king of the ages, king of the Jews, the king, the lamb, the lamb of God, the lamb without blemish, the last Adam, the lawgiver, the leader and commander, the life, the lie of the world, the lion of the tribe of Judah, the living one, the living stone, the Lord, the Lord, our righteousness. The Lord is my portion. The Lord is my strength. The Lord is my rock. The Lord is my salvation. The Lord is my refuge. The Lord is my high tower. The Lord is my good fortress. The Lord is my buckler. The Lord is my shield. Yes, he is my redeemer. Most definitely the branch. Most definitely the deliverer, the, re the healer. All of that, y'all. Praise him. The Lord, our God, there's no, there's no one like him, y'all. He is a sustainer, the sufficient one. Praise him. Our true salvation. All of that, y'all. Yah, Yahweh, Yahuwah, Yahweh, Yahweh, Ben Yahweh, Yahai, Yeshai, Yeshua, Hamashiach, Barakatha, Shalom, Ram Shalom, Yeshua, Elohim, Yehosha, Yehusha, Yahweh, Yahai, Yeshaya. Yes, He is Adonai. Yes, El Shaddai. Most definitely, y'all. He is the consuming fire. He is the father of lights, the father of the fatherless, the father of widows, the father of mercies. He is the God of heaven and earth. His son sits at the right hand of him. The government rests on his shoulders. He is the great physician, can heal all things. He is the carpenter, can fix all things with God. All things are possible. Nothing is too hard for the Lord. God made everything in six days and rest on the seventh day. He could fix your situation right now in the name of Jesus. We touch and agree most definitely, y'all. Praise him, call on him. Search after him, seek him with all your heart, people. He is a reward to those who seek him diligently. Must believe him, must have faith. Faith is what pleases him, people. Come on, y'all. Call on him. He'll show you great, mighty things, people. Praise him, y'all. Praise him. Nothing's too hard for the Lord, y'all. Nothing. Praise him, y'all. Get what you need. Get what you need. Yes. We are in agreement with the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Most definitely, he is the Lord of all, the Lord of glory, the Lord of lords, the man from heaven, the man of sorrows, the mediator of the new covenant, the mediator, the messenger of the covenant, the Messiah, the mighty God, the mighty one, the morning star, the Nazarene, the offspring of David, the only begotten son of God, our great God and savior, our holiness, our spiritual husband, our Passover, our protection, our redemption, our righteousness, our sacrificed Passover lamb, the power of God, the precious cornerstone, the prince of kings, the prince of life, the prince of peace, the prophet, the redeemer, the resurrection and life, the resurrection, the resurrection, Resurrector, the life, the revelation, the revelator, the righteous branch, the righteous one, the radiant one, the perfect example, the rock, the root of David, the rose of Sharon, the ruler of God's creation, the ruler of the kings of the earth, the savior, the seed of woman, the shepherd and bishop of souls, the Shiloh, the son of Abraham, the son of David, the son of God, the son of man, son of the blessed, son of the most high God, the source of eternal salvation for all who obey him, the son of righteousness, the just one, the one mediator, the stone to build is rejected, the true bread, the true God, the true light, the true vine. Yes, he is the truth. Amen. He is the way. Hallelujah. He is the way to the life. Praise him. The wisdom of God, the witness, the wonderful counselor, the word, the word of God, the word of life, the word of Yahuwah, the word of Elohim, the word of Yeshua HaMashiach, the word of Yahweh Shai, the true word most deaf for y'all. His word is pure, fine, silver, just as David said in Psalms. His every word of God is pure, as the book of Proverbs says, and his word is a double-edged sword, as the book of Hebrews says. Amen. We touch and agree, y'all, most definitely. Gotta give all the praise, honor to the most high. You have to, people. Gotta praise him and worship him in times like this. You need the Lord more than ever. We all need prayer, amen. We most likely do. we all mostly do. Yes, y'all, much love, Lord Jesus Christ, the Lord of all, the abiding son, the abolisher of the enemy, the abundant grace, the abundant life, the ancient of days, Adonai, the advocate, Aleph and Tau, Alpha and Omega, altogether lovely, amen, the anchor of souls, the angel of God, the angel of his presence, the angel of Jacob, the angel of the Lord, the anointed king, the anointed one, the anointed of the Holy Spirit, anointed preacher, anointed witness, anointed of my head, another king, another priest, anthem of a new song, apple tree, appointed heir, appointed judge, appointed of God, appointed sacrifice, appointer of seasons, approved of God, ark of strength, arm of his strength, arm of redemption, arm of the Lord, armor of God, assurance of our hearts, a stonied one, author and finisher of our faith, author of eternal salvation, arrow of conviction, arrow, author of peace with God, Arthur of the Book of Life, Availing Shield and Buckler, Baby of Bethlehem, Baby and Child of Promise, Balm of Gilead, Banner of Israel, Banner of Love, Baptizer, Bearer of the Seven Stars, Beautiful and Glorious Branch, Beauty of Holiness, Beauty of the Lord, Beginning and Ending, Beginning of Wisdom, Beloved White and Ruddy One, Mm-hmm. Beloved of the Father, beloved Son, better than angels, blessed and glorious Lamb, blessed and only potent, blessed and glorious name, blessed Lamb of glory, blessed one, blessed rock, blesser of the children, branch, branch of righteousness, bread, bread of heaven, bread of God, bread of life, 
breastplate of our righteousness, bridegroom, bridegroom lamb, bright light of glory, brightness of his glory, brightness of the Lord, brightness of thy rising, bringer of good things, brother of James, buckler to the upright, buckler to all, builder and maker, builder of the church, bruised and afflicted of God, bruiser of Satan, captain of salvation, captain of the Lord's host, carpenter, carpenter's son, chief cornerstone, chief shepherd, chiefest among 10,000, mm-hmm. child Jesus, child of the Holy Spirit, chosen of God, chosen stone of God, Christ Jesus, Christ Jesus, the Lord, Christ of God, Christ our life, Christ our peace, Christ the crucified, Christ the King of Israel, Christ the Lord, Christ the rock, Christ the son of David, Christ the son of God, Christ the son of the blessed, Christ the first fruits, cloud of the Lord, cluster of the campfire, comfort of the mourners, comforter of Zion, compassionate shepherd, consuming fire, confidence, conquering lamb, consecrated son, Consolation of Israel, complete controller of all, completer of the saints, contradiction of sinners, counsel of the most high, covenant of the people, covenant of promise, covert from the storm, creator of Israel, creator of the new heavens and earth, creator of principalities and powers, creator of the earth, creator of the heavens, creator of visible and invisible things, creator of the winds, crown of glory, crown of pure gold, darling, day's man, day spring from on high, day star, defense, deliverer, deliverer to Zion, deliverer of my soul, designer of the universe, desire of all nations, desire of our soul, desire of the bride, desire of the prophets and kings, desire of the righteous, desire of women, despised and rejected one, despised of the people, due of youth, due unto Israel, diadem of beauty, disallowed stone, door of faith, door of the sheep, dweller of the heavenlies. Mm -hmm. El Shaddai, enlarger of Gad, elect of the Lord, Elohim, enlarger of my heart, enlightener of my darkness, ensign, ensign for the nations, ensign for the people, enthroned priest, equal of God, establisher of the ends of the earth, eternal Christ, eternal life, eternal word, Eucharist of our faith, everlasting God, everlasting King, everlasting name, everlasting priest, ever living intercessor, ever living one, ever merciful one, exalted and extolled servant. Exalted God of salvation, exalted lamb, exalted name, exceeding joy, our God, our sure reward. <sighs> Excellency of God, excellent, excellent and comely one, executor of judgment, executor of righteousness, expectation of David, express image, eye of the Lord. Face of God, face of the Lord, fairer than children of man, faithful, the faithful ambassador, faithful creator, faithful Lord, faithful and just forgiver, faithful witness, faithfulness, father of the fatherless, fellow, first and last, first begotten, first born from the dead, fire of Zion, first born, first born among many brethren, first born from the dead, first born of every creature, first born son, first fruits of them that slept, mm. first love, yes, the excellence of God foreordained eternally the forerunner the former of all things the former of jacob and israel former of the light fountain of jacob fountain of the house of david framer of the worlds free gift friend friend forever friend of abraham friend of publican and sinners fruit of the earth fruit of the womb fullness of the father fullness of the godhead gardener of earth gatherer of winds of the winds gatherer of the winds the gentiles trust the gift of God, the giver of secrets and treasures of earth, the giver of the good spirit, the gladness of the nations, the glorious arm, glorious honor of thy majesty, glorious Lord, glorious voice with us, glory of gods, glory of Israel, glory of the Gentiles, God blessed forever, God manifest in flesh, God of David, God of great kindness, God of pardon and new life, God of righteousness and wrath, God of just run, God our savior, God with us, good and upright, good Lord, good shepherd, good teacher, good man of the house, governor, governor of many nations. Gracious God, gracious Lord, gracious and full of compassion, great counselor, great door, great God, great high priest, great king, great Lord, great one, great peace, great prophet, great savior, great shepherd, great and amazing God, greater than Abraham, greater than Isaac, greater than Jacob, greater than Jonah, greater than David, greater than Noah, greater than Solomon, greater than our hearts, greater and more perfect tabernacle, greatness of excellency, greatness of might, greatness of strength, greatness of thy power, greatness of Zion, green tree, guarantor of our security, guarantor of the new covenant, guarantor of the tree of life, guide for us, hand of the Lord, hanged redeemer, harmless, hated one, 
hater of iniquity, head above all, head of all principality and powers, head of every man, head of the body, head of the corner, head of the church, head over all, head over things, healer, healer of broken hearts, healer of souls, healer of wounds, health of my countenance, hearer of prayer, help of his countenance, helper of the helpless, heir of all things, hidden God, hidden manna, high above all. High and lofty one, high God, high Lord, high priest of good things, high priest of our profession, high priest over the house of God, high right hand, high tower of mine, higher than heavens, higher than kings, highest one, his brightness, his dear son, his excellent greatness, his holiness, his holy arm, his loving kindness, his mighty hand, his right hand, his son, Jesus Christ, his son, our Lord, holier than thou, holy and true, holy child, Jesus, holy Lord God, holy name, holy one, holy one and just, Holy One of God, Holy One of Israel, Holy One of Jacob, Holy One of Mount Paran, Holy Thing, Honorable Lamb of Glory, Honored Son, Hope in the Day of Evil, Hope of David, Hope of Eternal Life, Hope of Glory, Hope of His People Israel. Hope of Israel, hope of righteousness, hope of the promise, hope and joy of Abraham, hope and joy of Simeon, horn of David, horn of salvation, horn of the house of David, horn of the house of Israel, horn of my salvation, Hosanna of the highest praise, house of defense, humbler of the high minded, husband of Israel, husband of the bride, the I am, the I am, that I am, the I am, who I am, the great I am. Most definitely the image of God, the image of the believers, the image of the Father, the image of the invisible God, Emmanuel, immortal, incarnate God, infinite one, inheritor of all nations, inheritor of my mountains, intercessor of sinners, Jasper and Sardin stone, jealous God, Jesus, Jesus Christ, our Lord, Jesus Christ, our Savior, Jesus Christ, the righteous, Jesus of Galilee, Jesus of Nazareth, Jesus, the crucified, Jesus, the grace and truth, Jesus, the king of the Jews. Yes, the Jew, the judge, the judge among many nations. The judge among nations, the judge of all the earth, judge of Israel, judge of quick and dead, judge of the fatherless, judge of widows, justified of the spirit, justifier of the circumcision, justifier of the seed of Israel, just God, just Lord, just man, just one, just savior, keeper of Israel, keeper of the covenant and mercy, keeper of the keys of hell and death, kindler of Tophet, king beautiful, king eternal, king forever, king of all the earth, king of glory, king of heaven, king of Israel, king of Jacob, king of kings and lord of lords, king of nations. King of peace, king of righteousness, king of saints, king of the Jews, king of truth, king of Zion, kinsman nearer than I, kinsman redeemer, Kodashem, holy one, Korban, sacrifices, lamb, lamb of God, lamb of Mount Zion, lamb of the 144,000 sealed Israelites of the 12 tribes, lamb of salvation, lamb of the great multitude, lamb of the 12 apostles, lamb slain from the foundation. Lamb to the slaughter, lamb without spot and blemish, the lamp, the lamp of the feet, the last Adam, the leader, commander, the life, the life of man, the lifted and exalted son, the lifted up suffering symbol, the lifter of my head, the light and truth, the light everlasting, light in the darkness, light of heaven, light of Israel, light of life, light of men, light of the city, light of the Gentiles, light of the glorious God, light of the glory of God, the light of the path, the light of the world, light of thy countenance, lily among thorns, lily of the valley, lion of the tribe of Judah, lion of Zion, the living bread, the living redeemer, the living savior, the living stone, the long-suffering God, Lord and Christ, Lord and God, Lord and shepherd, Lord from heaven, Lord God of the holy prophets, Lord God of Mount Sinai, Lord Jesus Christ, Lord Jesus Christ, Lord of glory, Lord Messiah, Lord most high, Lord Yahuwah, everlasting strength, Lord of a new covenant, Lord of all, Lord of David, Lord of glory, Lord of heaven and earth, Lord of hosts, Lord of kings, Lord of lords, Lord of peace, Lord of heaven's riches, Lord of the harvest, Lord of the Sabbath, Lord of the scriptures, Lord of the second advent. Yes, the Lord of the whole earth, Lord, our hope, Lord, our judge, Lord, our king, Lord, our Lord, Lord, our maker, Lord, our righteousness, Lord, our shield, Lord, over all. Lord, the God of hosts, Lord, the judge, Lord, thy creator, Lord, thy redeemer, Lord, thy savior, love of righteousness, magnified Lord, magnified name, majesty, maker of all things, maker of Israel, maker of morning darkness, maker of one new man. <laughs> maker of peace, maker of the new way, maker of the path in the sea, man Christ Jesus, man of God, man of sorrows, man of thy right hand, man of war, man of from heaven, marred one, marred one, master in heaven, master of the house, master of the sea, mediator of a better covenant, mediator of the new covenant, mediator of the new testament, mediator between God and man, meek and lowly Jesus, merciful and faithful high priest, merciful God, messenger of the covenant, Messiah, Messiah, the prince, mightier than the mighty waves, mightier than the noise of any waters, mighty and strong one, mighty arm, mighty God, mighty hand of God, mighty man, mighty one of Israel, mighty one of Jacob, mighty power, mighty savior, mighty strength, mighty wisdom, mind of the Lord, mind anointed, mind elect, 
my holy one, minister of the circumcision, minister of the sanctuary, minister of the true tabernacle, most holy, most mighty, most upright, mystery of godliness, narrow gate, Nazarene, near Lord, obedient son, offspring of David, ointment, poured, the ointment poured, the one, true one, the one and only sacrifice, the one Lord, the one shepherd, only rock, ordained lamp of the anointed, ordained of the Father, ordainer of the preachers, our King, our Lord, our Passover, our peace, our Sabbath, our sin offering, overcomer, overcomer lamb, overcomer of the overcomers, overcomer of the principalities, overcomer of the world, overseer of the congregation, pattern of the believers, peacemaker, perfect peace, physician, great physician, excellent physician, pierced Messiah, pierced one, pillar of fire, plant of renown, pleased of the father, polished shaft, portion of Jacob, portion in the land of living, portion of mine inheritance, possessor of heaven and earth, potent, potter, power of God, powerful and rich lamb, praise of the children, praise of the saints, preacher of good things, preacher of righteousness, precious lamb, precious Lord, precious stone, preeminent one, preparer of heavenly places, preserver of men, preserver of saints, preserver of the word, preserver of the faithful, preserver of his creation, the priest, the priest forever of Melchizedek, the prince of life, the prince of princes, the prince of the kings of the earth, the prophet of his brethren, prophet from Nazareth of Galilee, prophet mighty deed and truth, propitation for sins, propitation of our faith, proverb to his people, pure one, quickening love, quickening spirit, quickening word, rabbi, rabbani, Ransom for all, recompenser, reconciler of enemies, reconciler of things earthly and heavenly things, redeemer and forgiver, redeemer of Abraham, redeemer of Israel, redeemer of souls, redeemer of the first testament, redeemer of Zion, redeemer the holy one, redeemer the lamb, redeemer the Lord of hosts, redemption, refiner and purifier, refuge for the oppressed, refuge for us, refuge from the storm, refuge in day of affliction, refuge in trouble, reigning lamb, reproach of men, rest for our souls, restore of Zion, reject the stone of builders, resurrection and judge, resurrection and the life, revealer of secrets, revealer of counsels of the heart, revealer of the hidden mystery, revealer of the hidden things, reverend, rewarder of servants and prophets, righteous, righteous and very faithful testimony. Right hand of David, right hand of my righteousness, righteous branch, righteous God, righteous judge, righteous man, righteous one, righteous rock, righteous servant, risen light, risen Lord, river of waters, rock higher than I, rock of Israel, rock of my refuge, rock of my salvation, rock of offense, rock of the church, rock of the wilderness, rock and fortress, rock our God, rock the Lord, rod and branch, rod of his mouth. Rod of my anger, rod of my strength, rod of thy inheritance, root of David, rose of Sharon, ruler of Israel, ruler of the 24 elders, salvation of all nations, salvation of God, salvation of the daughters of Zion, Mm -hmm. most definitely the salvation of all nations, the Samaritan helped out the Samaritan woman, the same Lord over all, the same stone of prophecy. Most definitely, he is the same yesterday, today, forever. Same word of eternity, sanctified and sent one, saving health, saving strength of his anointed, savior, savior Jesus, savior of all, savior of the body, savior of the law, savior of the world, scepter out of Israel, the scorned one, the searcher of hearts, the second man, the secret of thy presence, the seed of Abraham, promise, the seed of Adam, humanity, the seed of David, kingship, the seed of God, deity, the seed of Jacob, nationality, the seed of Judah, tribe, the seed of Shem, race, the seed of one prophecy. Amen. We touch and agree in the authority and the power in the name of Jesus Christ, you are healed, renewed, restored, redeemed, forgiven, embraced, loved, new mind, new heart, new soul. Yes, yes, new mind, new heart, new soul, renewed heart, people, renewed strength, stability, firmness, gladness, joy, rejoicing, merry heart, strength, vigilance, sober, alert, new creature of Christ, born again of spirit and water, baptism, repentance, holiness, purity, sanctified, consecrated, all those things, healings, deliverance, restoration, Miracle signs, wonders, dreams, visions, new song to sing, new dreams, new visions, new insight, new things the Lord is showing you forevermore. Yes, y'all. Get back to the first love, man. Let the Lord guide you forever, people. Praise the Lord, y'all. Praise him. Get what you need from the Father. Cry out to him for it, y'all. Cry out to him for it. 
He is the seeking shepherd, the self-existent one, the separate from sinners, the servant, the servant of rulers, the servant of the father, the servant of the Lord, shade upon thy right hand, shadow of a great rock, shadow of his hand, shadow of my hand, shadow of the almighty, shadow of thy wings, shalom of God, shekinah, glory, shelter, shelter of his flock, shepherd of Israel, shepherd of souls, shepherd of the flock, shepherd of the little flock, shepherd of the other sheep, shepherd of the sheep, shepherd of tender compassion, shepherd, shepherd of the valley, Shepherd lamb, shield for me, shield for thy help. Shield of thy help, the Shiloh, the shorn lamb, the sign spoken against, the silent and meek lamb, the sin bearer, the sinless high priest, the sinless one, sir, slayer of the enemy, smitter of the nations, smitten judge of Israel, smitten rock of Horeb, smitten shepherd, smitten of God, son of man, sower of the word of God, spirit of Christ, song of drunkards, song of drunkards. The son from heaven, son of David, son of freedom, son of God, son of Joseph, son of man in heaven, son of man, the savior, son of Mary, son of peace, son of the father, son of the free woman, son of the highest, son of the living God, son of truth, son over his house, spiritual drink, spiritual meek, spiritual meat, spiritual rock, spiritual drink, spoiler of the principality, spokesman of the father, sprinkler of nations and kings, star out of Jacob, the stay, the stiller of the raging sea, the stone cut without hands, the stone of Israel, the stone of stumbling, the stone the builders rejected, the stranger and alien, the strength and song, the strength and time of trouble, the strength of Israel, the strength of my heart, the strength of my life, the strength of the children. The strength of the Lord, the strength to the needy, mm. the strength to the poor, the stretched out arm, outstretched arm, strong arm, strong habitation, strong hand, strong Lord, strong redeemer, strong power, strong rock, strong hold, strong tower, stumbling stone, son of righteousness, sure foundation, sure mercies of David, sure steadfast anchor, surety of a better testament, surety of David, sustainer, sufficient one, sword of thy excellency, tabernacle, tabernacle of God, teacher from God, teacher of David, teacher of my path. Tempest of hail and destroying storm. Whew. Temple, temple of the city, tender plant. Excellent God, amazing God, awesome God, wonderful God. Terrible, um, amazing excellence of the kings. Testament of a prophecy, tested her. The testimony of the scriptures, that bread, that eternal life, that one from the beginning, that prophet, that rock, the creator, the everlasting arm, the excellent delight, the glorious honor of thy majesty, the glory of their strength, the grace of God, the highest, the just, the justification of life, the justification of many. The king, the Lord, my hiding place, the Lord, my help and deliverer, the love of God, the man, the manifest life, the mercy of the most high. The mighty, the mighty of Jacob, the rock of our salvation, the savior, the victory, the savior of upright hearts, the secret of the Lord, the son of the Lord God, the song of Moses, the sower, the straight gate, thine holy one, thresher of wheat and chaff, throne of God's holiness, thou Christ, tower of David, tower and fortress, tower of salvation, the trampler of the young lion and dragon, the treader of the angry waves, the treader of the high places, the treader of the lion and adder, treader of the wine press, mm-hmm. Thy glorious name, thy kindness and marvelous comfort, thy staff and comfort, thy praise, treasure of wisdom, the tried stone, the triumph Christ, triumph overcomer, triumph lamb, true and faithful witness, true and righteous judge, true bread from heaven, true God and eternal life, true light, true vine, truth, uncorrupted and glorified one, uncomprehendable light, undefiled, unknown God, unspeakable gift, upholder of all things, upholding right hand, valiant right hand, veil to the new and living way, the very beautiful king, very Christ, very foundation of the church, very God of peace, very great, very high, very high priest, very high servant, very lovely song, very present help, very pure word, victorious king and Lord, victorious Lord Jesus Christ, victorious one, victory, Ooh, victory is mine, y'all. It's yours. Victory is yours, y'all. Divine. The voice of great thunder, the voice of many waters, the voice of the Almighty, the voice of the Lord God, the wall of fire, Whew. water of life, the way, the way everlasting, the way of salvation, the way of the just, the way of the Lord, the way to the holiest, the weakness of God, the well-beloved of God, the well-beloved son, the white linen of the saints, the white stone, the wisdom, the wisdom and knowledge, the wisdom of the just, the wise and strong lamb, the witness, the, the witness of the father, the witness of truth, the witness to the people. Yes, he is the wonderful counselor, the word, the word made flesh, the word of God, word of his power. The word of life, the word of righteousness, the word of the Lord, the worshipful Lord, worthy lamb of heaven, worthy Lord Jesus, worthy redeemer, worthy servant, wounded one in house of friends, mm. 
wounded one for transgressors, the yoke of peace and rest, the young child, the zeal of the Lord of hosts, the zealous one. Amen. We touch and agree, y'all. Praise the Lord. Yes, the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Yes, we are in agreement. Praise the Most High, y'all. He is looking out for us. He is doing it, y'all. Stay near to him. Amen. So there you have it. All right. So that's the word for today. Okay. Now, what I would love to do is I close out this message, give you all the priestly blessing on the way out. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Shalom. I'm Jarvis Kingston. I love you all. Praying for you all. Peace.